and welcome to a special edition of Archive Riffs, recorded at an undisclosed location. Now, normally when I do one of these videos, uh, I'm at my box for one thing, but normally when I do one of these, I'll pull something from archive.org or off of one of my public domain DVDs or VHS tapes, but today I'm going to break my own rule because the timing is simply too perfect not to riff this one. So what I've got for you and what you should be seeing on screen is a VHS tape generically titled Selling Your Home. And initially this tape was as mysterious as its box. Nowhere on the box or tape proper does it list exactly what the video is about. Uh, I was actually expecting like a commercial or promo video from maybe one of the major real estate brokerage firms, uh, you know, list your house with us, you know, that sort of thing. But what I got was a five minute promo video for an item that's been covered on Archive twice and has been used about a dozen times to date in various archive projects. And specifically, the tape is for the Talking House Transmitter, which is a Part 15 friendly AM radio transmitter that'll get you about a two to three hundred foot broadcast radius. So between my own history with the product and the fact that I'm in the process of moving as of making this, this was too perfect not to tackle. So with that, let's take a look, and a pretty honest one at that, at a video touting the original circa 1999 Talking House Transmitters. I'm a renter, but uh, what the hell? Sounds like fun. Imagine how much interest could be generated in your home and how quickly it would sell if your real estate agent stood at the curb and waited for potential buyers to drive up. Oh, damn, I thought that was a guard dog. You could get a flattering description of every asset your home has to offer. Let me take this opportunity to tell you about this new listing we have. It's a uh, two-story colonial. Dude, we were just going to ask directions. That's exactly what you get with the talking house. Every potential buyer who drives up can learn all about your home by simply... Hey, I was listening to that. ...corner stone fireplace. Upstairs, the master suite is... Ex Who'd have thought you'd get such great sound with the bass and treble turned off? And the words to describe the bathroom is simply just a romantic... Whirlpool. I know I like it when my bathroom sweeps me off my feet. Market today, the talking house gives you the advantage over other sellers, and it gives your home a whole new level of curb appeal. Never mind that all the windows are broken. More than half of all buyers find their homes by driving through neighborhoods they'd like to live in. But for buyers, driving around can be a frustrating experience. The more homes they see, the harder it is to remember which house is which. Oh man, imagine all the trouble they're going to have when they move in. Dozens of phone numbers. Chances are they'll only wind up calling one or two. But when they get to a talking house, it's different. Instead of just slowly passing by, buyers stop. Oh, it's another one of those jackasses that plays Christmas music, isn't it? You'll fall in love with this 2,900 square foot, four or five bedroom home. The moment four or five? Or if you're in beautiful downtown Aurora, one or 12. Didn't get, as the talking house broadcasts a description that actually paints a picture in the minds of the buyers. Couldn't you do all this with flyers? Nation, facts and figures, in a way that makes your home stand out among the rest. To the breakfast nook that overlooks the large secluded backyard. <laughs> or as secluded as you can get without offense. On your right will be a formal dining room with hardwood floors and built-in custom cabinetry. And custom plastic flowers. One of the home's greatest features, a 16 by 32 family living area that includes a breathtaking stone hearth fireplace. Well, breathtaking when the buyers find out the hard way that the fireplace is decorative and the chimney is all sealed up. The uniqueness of the talking house makes your home much more memorable than other properties. Relax in uninterrupted peace. And that motivates buyers. Okay. 75000 with no money down, and that's my final offer. Lots of other buyers are tuning in as well. John Prine is not impressed. Might be right for them. And that's one of the other benefits of the talking house. It makes the whole selling process easier for you. 
As the talking house draws in the hottest prospects, it also weeds out the few people who would never buy your house. But they'll still listen and take notes so they know which areas to hit first when they rob the place. Interested buyers should call your agent, eliminating the annoyance of people knocking on your door. Yeah, right. Importantly, the talking house helps your home sell fast for top dollar. The longer a house sits on the market, the more likely it is to sell for well under the asking price. But because the talking house markets your home to so many buyers so quickly, there's a real sense of urgency. A certain desperation, if you will. Offers right away. The talking house is actually a small broadcast unit that plugs into any outlet and tucks away neatly. Of course, it's fully FCC approved. Go ahead, throw on some method, man. Those or telephones. In fact, the only way you'll know your home is on the air is by seeing all the cars that stop and tune in. Not to mention the ever-growing sense of paranoia from seeing all those parked cars. Thousands are in use today, and their unique approach to marketing homes has made them indispensable. Indispensable to hobbyists like myself. Homes that talk just sell faster. And best of all, the talking house doesn't eliminate any other promotions your agent uses. A dented can of green beans will still get you $3 off. It's the kind of extra exposure that can only help your home sell faster for top dollar. Now this comes with all the furniture, right? Crowd makes it stand out and catches the full attention of every potential buyer. Don't settle for less than full service for something as important as selling your home. Damn right. I'm going to make sure that agent stands out front 24-7. Thanks, Talking House. Talking House. Okay, I'd like to point out a few quirks regarding the Talking House that aren't mentioned in the video. One, the six-foot wire antenna that comes with the unit needs to be fully extended at all times and most likely will have to be taped to the ceiling. Two, do not place the transmitter near any metal or windows as it will stunt your already limited broadcast range. Three, if you're dumb enough to touch the antenna during a broadcast, you will, at least temporarily, short out your broadcast. Four, the built-in microphone has a frequency response that makes pre-electric recordings seem like modern audiophile quality by comparison. And lastly, number five, Assuming your unit has a separate input, if you want the sound to be even remotely on par with commercial stations, be prepared to need external EQ and compression pads. Sold set. Congratulations! This Talking House transmitter is a powerful marketing tool. We put this message on your transmitter as part of our quality control testing. Anytime you plug in a transmitter, always remember to stretch the antenna out first before you plug it in. That way, the transmitter tunes itself for maximum range. The motor sound you may have heard after plugging it in was the transmitter tuning itself.